Hey there, Mac from Maddox, here with another quick tip for you. In previous videos, we talked about cooling classes for liquid filled transformers. And today, we're looking at cooling classes for dry type transformers. Let's start with a quick refresher. Basically, all transformers generate heat when they're running. And a cooling class describes the system a transformer uses to keep itself cool. You'll usually see it on the nameplate as an abbreviation. Now let's break down the most common cooling classes for dry types and what those abbreviations actually mean. First up, transformers rated AA, FA, or AAFA. These transformers have ventilation openings in their enclosures like this. AA or AN transformers, these are self-cooled units. The A stands for air, and the second A, or N for natural, means natural airflow does the cooling. You may also see these labeled as ANN, which means the same thing. AFA transformers. This type still uses air as the cooling medium, but with the addition of forced air circulation, which is the FA part. Think fans pulling in air through those ventilation openings to boost cooling. AA slash FA, also called AFN or AF transformers, are ventilated and self-cooled, AA, with a forced air rating as well. This is the FA part. When the self-cooled ratings are exceeded, fans engage and add forced air circulation. Extended forced air rating with fans can add an additional 33% loading capacity above the base rated KVA. Lastly, let's talk about ANV or ANC transformers. These are self-cooled, but non-ventilated, which is what the NV or NC stands for. This means that the transformer does not have any external ventilation. One example of this is encapsulated transformers. Sometimes these transformers have fins on the outside of the enclosure to increase the surface area for heat transfer. And that's the basics of dry type transformer cooling class. If you want to dive deeper, check out the article on our website linked in the description below. And don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button for more transformer tech tips like this one. See you next time.